shit, Cliff. I do not deserve this shit! Ugh, gross! Um, okay. Okay, I'm just vamping here. Then, <clears throat> then, Ezekiel noticed whiskers. I mean, he really noticed him. Why, he had been so busy becoming the architect of the apocalypse and all that he had failed to see what was right before his eyes. But there he was. Ezekiel's right hand in the destruction of this loathsome world. Another meek and forgotten creature. It was as if a soul had been split in two and they were finding their way back together again. The yearning was palpable. It was intoxicating. Really? Oh, whiskers. It was in that moment that Ezekiel lost all other appetites. He hungered for one thing, and one thing only. And that was Ratatouche. Mm. Oh. Mm. Knowing that his greatest fear was also his greatest power, Larry knew it was time to rip through this impenetrable dimension. All of the pieces were clicking into place! The story's riveting end was finally upon us. So, the cockroach eats them to protect them from the radiation. I get that, but... What happens to us? Oh, shit.